What's going on, you guys? This is Madam, and I'm coming to you once again, and this is from RadarOnline.com. This is an exclusive, and it says Jesse Williams demands 15K from Crucial Witness in car crash battle for blowing off deposition moves to postpone trial. And uh, the article is by Ryan Newman, and it says actor Jesse Williams demands the civil trial over a car crash be postponed after a crucial witness failed to show up at a deposition Radar Online has learned. According to the court documents obtained by RadarOnline.com, Williams and his legal team are demanding 15K from the son of a woman suing him. Mm -mm. As Radar Online previously reported, Paula Bruce sued Williams over a January 2020 accident that went down in Los Angeles. In the suit, Bruce accused the star of fleeing the scene after he had a had real ended her. In the court documents, Bruce and Williams crashed in crashed his Porsche into her Mercedes, which caused se- severe damage. In addition, she claimed to have suffered emotional distress from the ordeal, which led her, which led to her not being able to work. Williams had declined the accusation. He fled from the scene. He said he stayed and exchanged information. Williams admitted he left once his assistant arrived at the scene. The actor said he called Bruce days after the accident to check on her. He claimed to have been told by Bruce that she was fine. Days later. He said her, his lawyer informed him Bruce was demanding $1.6 million in damages for a hit and run. Williams called it a blatant attempt to add extortion. And that is the end. Oh, oh, no, no, that's not the end. Excuse me. These things be getting in the way. These uh, ads be getting in the way. So I apologize about that. It continues on to say that now Williams has filed a motion to come excuse me, to compel Bruce's son, Felix Moritz, to appear for a deposition in the case. The actor said Moritz is a crucial factual witness in the case, but has refused to appear. Williams has demanded 15K in sanctions against Moritz and his lawyer for their games, gamemanship and blatant abuse of the discovery process in the matter. He said Bruce has identified her son as a witness who saw Williams flee the scene. However, he said Mort has been invading being questioned under the oath in the case. Williams has been contacted has contact has been contacting Bruce's counsel, who is also representing Mort about Mort's deposition for months. In response, Bruce's counsel has been nothing but uh, strategically misrepresented Moritz's ability and provide vague responses designed to improperly delay or entirely prevent Moritz's deposition. This is a textbook gamemanship and in yet another transparent attempt to prevent Williams from attaining rel- relevant non-privileged testimony from a key witness to the claims and defense asserted in this litigation. His motion read, as a result, Williams wants more to force the appeal for the July trial date to be pushed to October. And that is the end of the article right there. As everything stands, apparently, you know, uh, the sun doesn't want to show up, allegedly, for whatever reason. You can speculate that on your own. But I, my, what I think is that, you know, um, well, I mean, if your mom is suing for all this money, why wouldn't you, you know, show up to, you know, help your mom out? Um, Even though under law, it is a crime to give any testimony that is false, um, even if it's in favor of a family member or anyone else. It is a crime, and it is punishable by jail time and fines. Everyone knows this. You know, I'm assuming everyone knows this. But, you know, just come and do the deposition. If it is, in fact, what you said it was, and Jesse, 
uh, Williams allegedly was seen fleeing the scene, uh, even though he stated that he got your con, he, you know, uh, gave you his contact information and called you days later to check and see if you were fine. And he only left the scene once his assistant showed up. Um, you know, you can explain that. You can be a crucial piece in your mother's case for that $1.6 million that she's suing for. So, uh, what you gonna do, bro? You gonna keep running? Uh, if they do, uh, the steps that they take after that will be because of your failure to come and, quote-unquote, speak your truth in a deposition. And that's pretty much where it is, you know. Um, maybe this might be thrown out or, you know, a countersuit may be put in place to allegedly uh, for the emotional stress <laughs> that Jesse Williams is possibly receiving from this, uh, allegedly. So, hey, we will see. I will keep you updated as always. And now is the time for you to drop down in the comment section as we always do. And let's chop it up. Tell me how you feel about this story. What do you think? Are you um, pointing more so to the victim Bruce's side in this case? Or are you pointing more so to Jesse Williams' side in this case? I would definitely like to know. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video or any of my videos that I have on my channel. Thank you so much. I do appreciate you watching my video as always. And I will get back with you with more news later.